This is an example of the nuclear biscuit, the card that contains the codes required to launch a nuclear warhead, and Bill Clinton lost it. In 2000, the Department of Defense was conducting their monthly check and update of the nuclear codes. But for the past couple months, the code checkers have been told that Clinton was in an urgent meeting and were only given verbal confirmation by Clinton's aide that the codes were with him. But that wasn't the case. As it turns out, the codes have been misplaced. Nobody knew where they were for at least two months, just assuming they were with Clinton and his aide. Within minutes, the Department of Defense had issued and implemented replacement placement codes, and an investigation was launched to figure out what exactly went wrong. Thankfully, it would be impossible for one person to do anything with the codes alone, as it's a multi-layered system. That being said, the nuclear codes are a single point of failure in that system, so it was impossible to respond to an active nuclear threat in the United States for a few months. Now the Department of Defense code checkers required to personally view the codes during the monthly checkup, as one would hope would have been the case all along, but you live and learn.